It's okay. I'm damn hungry. Today eat what? Uh? Chicken rice? At least go out, look at the weather, so hot. We order lah. But grab so many chicken rice to order. Which one do we choose? Okay, I got idea. How about we order the three best rated chicken rice? Okay, let's do it. Finally, the food is here. Isabel, I think you're starving, right? Uh, yeah. So the first chicken rice I'll be trying is Muhammad Noor Hakim Chicken Rice from Take Geekot, which is rated 4.7 stars of bread food. Mm. Wow, crispy skin. But why some of the pieces no skin? Ah? <laughs> Seven pieces, only four got skin. So this chicken rice is $6 for roasted chicken rice. Terrible. Hey, what got here? I'm going cheers. Huh? Why okay, did you cheers? Right? <laughs> I'm just going to go straight in the chili. Mm. I think the chili carries the chicken rice for me because I think I drenched it. The chili is very nice. It's like yeah. very thick and like the flavour is mm -hmm. there. Mm -hmm. Very spicy. Wait. Mm. It's not bad. Yeah, it's not bad but um a bit muted. Like meh. A bit on the dry side. It's a decent chicken rice. Mm. Can eat. I, I think there are nice. like better yeah. chicken out there because it's not as soft. As the chili is really good, but everything else is like average. The chili is also like personal <laughs> preference, I guess. Like it's nice. Out of five, right? How much would you rate? Three. Three also. It's not bad, but it's not mind blowing as well. Yeah. Mm. I'm just gonna lick the plate clean anyway. Three. Mm. Give it like a three at best. Mmm, mm, this one, them kind of cheetah for all skin. <laughs> Our second chicken rice is from Haki Rose Duck at Bishan Street 13 with a rating of 4.8 stars. Cost 560. Very pricing. This one is all skinned. Mm. Chili looks like Thai. The chili looks more sweet. Like, why is it so like, 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 It looks like the Thai sweet chili. I think the coriander. You like coriander, right? I love coriander. One of the rare people who like coriander. Huh? Oh, this one is um, roasted style. I don't know. I'm not a very big fan. <laughs> this chili is very light. Hey, you can smell the lime. Mm. First impression is more flavorful. But we all know. We'll tell, we'll tell. Cheers. <laughs> oh, the sesame oil taste is more pronounced in this chicken, which I like. Mm. Mm. The chicken is softer though. Mm. Okay, this one the meat is less dry. What you say is right. Stronger mm. sesame oil taste. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I feel like the chili isn't as good for this one, but the chicken is better. The rice is. I think the rice is. Not the rice better. is. Okay. It's fragrant, but it doesn't have the chicken rice bite. I feel like I don't know. Is it cause it's a dark store, right? And then my mind tells me like, oh, it's, it's a it's like a braised dark rice you know? fun. Mm -hmm. you know? mm -hmm. I think that rice is nicer. I agree. Okay, chicken rice fragrance wise, I, the previous one stronger. The rice only. Mm. Mm. But this rice is fragrant inside. It's, it's its own. Mm. On its own. Mm. Mm. I give this a three point five. Three point five as well. The last one better blow our minds. Two point five. Two point eight. So is it? Because I think it's a bit lower, but not that much lower. I'm gonna continue eating later. Mmm. Mmm. This looks expensive. Oh. Oh. Oh wow. You know it's expensive when it comes with like three thousand different sauces. Five goes into twenty-five, five times. Oh my god. It comes with even tomatoes. Where's this from? I see. It's from the dining room at Sheraton Towers Singapore Hotel. It's forty-one ninety-seven. Even more expensive than my cheddar box. Eh. You know what place is Atas when the chicken rice is served in a bowl? Instead of a normal cucumber, you have cherry tomato, Japanese cucumber, and bok choy. Japanese cucumber, eh. Three types of sauces. Yeah, one look, you can see that the chicken is thicker. La. <laughs> oh. This one's so much description. For you want, Alisa, I must describe a lot. Is it sponsored? The fun better blow me away. I'm very excited, but I'm also very nervous. Same. Yeah, yeah, we said, we said, okay. <laughs> I don't like the soup. I think the soup is very average. Everything in one big but I don't really know what to say. A bit glutinous rice feels. A bit wet. 
Oh, oh my got tomato one. Ah. Yeah, okay, okay, I, I, it's I, expensive. I, oh my God, it's... Okay. Mmm. The chicken is really much softer. But I feel like I don't really get very pronounced anything from the chicken. I think the rice is quite normal. That rice is still nicer. Do you think this is a letdown because of the price? Okay, it's a normal price chicken rice is quite good. good. Uh. Mm. But then if you take into account the cost of it, I don't think it's worth it. Yeah, I wouldn't pay for only $2. The, the chicken is really good. Mm -hmm. But if not, and they give like extra ingredients, they even give like these kind of vegetables. But I wouldn't say it's, the chicken is very good. Comparing to those two, it's, of course it's good, but I wouldn't mm. say it's like excellent. And it's like 10 times the price. Also, the cut of the chicken is much thicker also. Objectively, I have to give this a 3.5 or so. Unfortunately. Okay, I will give it a 4, but if it's a normal chicken rice, I don't mind giving it higher, but mm, because okay. of the price, I will give it a 4. I agree, I agree. No, yeah, it's not really worth the price point of $41.97. Uh, 4. Like about 3.94. Yeah. Not bad. Not a high 4. Minus points for the price and also the rice. But even, if you, that rice? Like, even if you tell me it was $5, I would still say 4. Who is gonna pay $40 for this? This guy. Wait, so what's the idea for this video? Like, just trying three different price points. I think he wants to like try the high rated on grab food. Then oh. we like try to like see whether does it like match the 